Samsung showcased a fully automated smartphone manufacturing process at one of its factories in Gumi, South Korea. In these factories, robots play a key role in assembling devices, minimizing human involvement, and significantly speeding up production. After receiving all the necessary components, robots initiate the installation process using automated systems that ensure high precision. Following this, the devices undergo soldering and assembly of the casings, where all parts of the device are connected into a single structure. The most remarkable aspect is that humans are almost entirely absent from the assembly process, because robots play a crucial role at every stage. Factories like the one in Gumi are renowned not only for their production innovations, but also for being important research and development centers, helping Samsung maintain its leadership in the smartphone market. The Dexterous Hands RH56DFX series robotic hand from Inspire Robots Company is an advanced solution for use in robotics and prosthetics. It features an innovative linear actuator with six miniature servos and six built-in pressure sensors. These sensors provide high precision and flexibility in performing complex gripping tasks, mimicking the movements of a human hand. One of the key features of this hand is its six degrees of freedom and 12 motorized joints, allowing it to perform a wide range of movements and effectively manipulate objects. The robotic hand supports the robot operating system, making it easier to integrate into robotic systems and enabling its use in complex operations. This model can be utilized both in robots and as prosthetics, providing reliable grip and movement control. Recently, another unique robot named Geminoid DK has resurfaced, originally introduced back in 2011. At the time, the robot amazed everyone not only with its realistic facial expressions, but also with its striking resemblance to Danish professor Henrik Scharfe from Aalborg University. Geminoid DK was developed by engineer Hiroshi Ishiguro and his team from the Advanced Telecommunications Research Institute International. What sets Geminoid DK apart from other similar machines is that it has a beard, just like the Danish professor. In fact, the beard and all the other hair were manually implanted and trimmed by the same hairdresser who regularly styles Henrik Scharfe. The robot's shoulders, neck and face are equipped with pneumatic actuators, allowing it to simulate breathing, blink, and change facial expressions. Geminoid DK is designed to study human-robot interaction, particularly the reactions of people when they encounter a robotic version of a real person. Specialists from IHMC Robotics and Boardwalk Robotics have showcased the development process of their advanced robot named Nadia, which according to a recently released video, is already honing new boxing skills. The robot is designed to perform tasks in dangerous environments for humans, such as participating in rescue missions or space exploration. According to the developers, Nadia is currently one of the most complex humanoid robots in terms of design. Its 29 joints allow for a wide range of movements. This intricate mechanism is intended so that the operator controlling the robot can act intuitively without having to think about how to use the manipulators correctly. IHMC Robotics hopes that their creation will serve as a prototype for future robots and could also be useful for military purposes. Today, the world of robotics welcomed a new player. Chinese company Pudu Robotics unveiled its next-generation humanoid robot Pudu D7. Pudu D7 stands 165 centimeters tall and weighs 45 kilograms. Its arm span is 65 centimeters, making its physical dimensions close to that of a human. The robot has 30 degrees of freedom, which increases to 50 when equipped with dexterous hands, allowing it to perform a wide range of tasks requiring high precision and flexibility. The Pudu D7's chassis supports omnidirectional movement with 360-degree rotation, reaching a maximum speed of 2 meters per second. The robot can operate stably on slopes of up to 10 degrees. With a battery capacity of over 1 kilowatt hour, it can function autonomously for more than 8 hours, making it a reliable assistant throughout a workday. Its bionic arm has a lifting capacity of up to 10 kilograms, with a positioning accuracy of 0.1 millimeters. Pudu D7 is expected to hit the market in 2025.
Sanctuary AI company has showcased progress in the development of its humanoid robot named Phoenix. The robot has learned new skills, such as dusting, sorting objects, brewing coffee, and pouring drinks. It is equipped with a unique AI-driven control system called Carbon, which enables it to demonstrate human-like cognitive abilities. Phoenix stands 170 centimeters tall and weighs 70 kilograms, making it comparable to human size. It can lift loads of up to 20 kilograms and move at speeds of up to 4.8 kilometers per hour. One of its key features is its hands, which have 20 degrees of freedom, making them incredibly flexible and capable of performing delicate manipulation tasks. Thanks to tactile feedback technology, the robot can sense objects much like a human. In terms of applications, Phoenix has already been tested in various scenarios, ranging from packing and sorting goods to labeling and cleaning environments. At a recent robotics exhibition in Japan, Mujin showcased an updated version of its advanced robot designed to handle goods of various types and sizes, capable of picking them from containers or conveyors. The robot uses Mujin's proprietary 3D vision system, which accurately recognizes and processes a wide range of items, from boxes to bottles and flexible packages. The system can autonomously recognize over 300,000 different types of products, making it ideal for large warehouses. Mujin robots can carefully place items into containers without damaging them, which is especially important when dealing with fragile products like electronics and pharmaceuticals. Mujin robots are widely used in industries such as e-commerce, pharmaceuticals, and warehousing, where automating sorting, packing, and order fulfillment processes helps increase efficiency. Wabian 2 is a humanoid robot developed at Waseda University in Japan to study human movement and create rehabilitation equipment. This robot can imitate human walking thanks to its flexible pelvis, legs with six degrees of freedom, and unique joints that allow it to perform full heel to toe movements. Wabian 2 is also used for testing rehabilitation equipment and can perform exercises alongside humans, aiding in the research of motor function recovery. The robot stands 148 centimeters tall, weighs 64 kilograms, and has a total of 41 degrees of freedom. Following upgrades to its design, Wabian 2 can now step in place, with each step taking just 0.6 seconds, which is the same amount of time as a human step. Write in the comments what you liked most after watching this video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. Goodbye.